risking your freedom to protect Betty is the first step to becoming a hero. So that's how I can become a hero in this one. Putting others in danger to save yourself is the first step to becoming infamous. Ooh, so this is how the decision making works. What's up fam, this is Lethal Tank and welcome to Infamous Second Son. So this is a game that I played uh, some years ago. Uh, it's one of my favorite games though. I really enjoyed it. It's, it's pretty much a, a decision making game. And you have like these powers. You play as this guy who has these powers and you have to make decisions on being good or bad. I hope you guys enjoy this though. Seven years ago, a small group of humans called Conduits emerged, each with the ability to manipulate and even weaponize a unique form of matter. The Department of Unified Protection was formed to hunt down and indefinitely detain all Conduits, reclassified as bioterrorists, to protect the population. It's now believed that all bioterrorists have been successfully captured and locked away. As a result, the Department of Unified Protection is being phased out, with the military assuming oversight of all imprisoned bioterrorists. Today, the first military transport of bioterrorists leaves the DUP detention facility at Curtin K Station, headed for an army prison in upstate Washington. It will never arrive. sideways oh 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 I forgot about this part so I just I do that right over here too Ooh. is that all Art is a crime, then just okay, think, Delson. Think. Ah, party at the Longhouse. Just gotta get there, mingle, establish an alibi. I'm a criminal mastermind. out there it's just me Betty Delson. would you put the stapler down seriously what are you doing here why aren't you at the big to do at the longhouse um uh yeah I just didn't feel all that accomplished tonight but you look amazing it looks great on you seriously what were you doing up on the roof hmm nothing just were you up to mischief Come on, I know you're in there, so just come on out, or I'll call Betty and she'll be here in five minutes with the keys. <laughs> you're up to mischief. Okay, well, come on, seriously, what are you gonna do here? Uh, uh, well, I have no choice. He's a cop. 
I have to be back here in five minutes, and if you're still here... <laughs> Thanks, Betty. This is the last, last time. time. Now I have to go back to my office. Apparently, I'm getting a phone call. Alright, so the Dead cops man. are after us. Okay. Um Alright, so where do I even go? I gotta find a way out of here. That guy is still at the door. Okay, I could go out here. Hello, freedom. Perfect. Out the and side. And now the easy part. Get to the longhouse, set up an alibi. Well, how do I do that? Find a safe way off? Yep, let's just go down. Alright, jump with that. Can I climb? Oh my god. Oh. Can I? Okay. Jump! Oh! Oh my oh. gosh! Uh, wow, I can't even get across safely. Alright, let's try this again. Can I jump on that? Jump! Okay, okay, I made it this time. Okay, let's go over here. Get out of my way! Seems like I'm in the right direction. <laughs> so apparently I, I can't touch water. Um, let's climb over here. Ah, gold crap. Jump down. All right. Let's make our way around here. Halfway there. Halfway there. Let's go. Alright. Let me go through here. Um, can I climb up? Alright. Uh, do I go that way? Let's try going that way. No! Oh. I thought I was gonna drown. Oh my gosh. I can't climb on rocks. Got it. I can't climb on like the side. So maybe if I jump there and then try to. Yeah! There we go. Can I get up? Can I not? What? Okay. Am I supposed to jump on this? Does that work? Can oh I jump on God, this? Just stop oh doing that. Gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, did I go here? Wait. Get across. Shoot, 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 get out of here. Okay. That was close. Okay, let's go over here. I hope I'm going in the right direction. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know how I don't got look down, Don't look that down, water. don't look down. But apparently you jump in the water and you make it across. I don't know. Right. And the plan is working perfectly. Alibi. Yeah, boy. Open the door. Do I? Oh, I swipe. Okay. Hey, man. I've been looking like forever for you. We should probably just get inside. Do you have any idea how embarrassing it is for me to keep arresting my own brother over and over and over again? Maybe you should stop arresting your brother over and over and you over again. You think this is a joke? No, I is don't. Is this how you want to leave your mark on the world, huh? 
You think this would make our parents proud? Misdemeanor vandalism? Listen, man, there's a lot of scary shit in the world. And while I'm out there actually trying to assert my talent... You're trying to assert your talent? I mean, what the hell are you always talking this, about? Reggie? Why don't you just let me be who I am? Tell me what big, bad, if scary you would listen, shit you're going to say I would explain it to you. Really? Because I don't seem to Reggie. get it. What? Truck. I'm going after those two. You stay back. That thing's gonna blow. Stay away from the exploding thing. Got it. Uh, why? Um. All right. So let's search for some survivors. How's the military doing? You okay? Uh, holy shit, dude. <laughs> oh, thanks, man. I thought I was gonna die. Hey, you all right? Hey, let him go! Just let him go and keep your hands where I can see him. I don't want to hurt nobody. I just want to get going before she gets here. I said let him go or I will shoot you. Fresh. I said I don't want to hurt nobody. Reg? I gotta find Reggie. Oh! What the heck was that? I... What the heck? What is happening to me? My God, no! Stop it, stop it, stop it! What's going on? Uh, oh my god. Oh my god. Make it stop! Hey, hey. Reg! Reg, I really need you! Yo, every time I move the stick, oh, it does that. I gotta get through here. Oh, okay, I can walk. Oh, okay. That was weird. So I could press circle to do that. So how do I get across? Can I jump? Oh, dash through? What is going on? Okay. Oh my gosh. Reggie! Yeah. Okay. Whoa! No! Reggie! Reg? You okay? No. What brother. was that? I gotta get that thing off you. You just... I gotta get you out! Help him! Okay. Okay, just... Just help me push! Uh... Yeah. Oh, move car. Okay. Do I press it? Okay, there we go. Uh, press and hold and touch pad with both thumbs, okay? There we go. Oh, dear God! No, no, no! My brother. I can't stop it, man. I can't stop it. Reggie, I can't okay. stop it's it, okay. man. It's okay. You're okay. Just breathe. Breathe. You're right. You're right. I'm one of them, man. I'm no. one of them. No. No. You are my brother. All right? You are my brother. Okay. This thing with you is going to pass. I promise. We'll fix it. All right? You with me? You with me? Okay. Okay. Gotta get out there. There is a bio so we gotta stop him before he gets to the rest of the tribe. All right? Okay. I need you. I need you right now. Okay. All right? Come on. Yeah. You good? Yeah. Let's go. Follow Reggie to the... Wow, Reggie's fast. Just promise me you won't use any of those tricks, okay? I wouldn't have been able to even get to you back there if I hadn't. Just promise me you won't do that. Okay. How do you run hey. so fast? Just, I don't want you to think what's happened is, is a good thing. 
Okay. And it's not. Sheriff, we can't get in! The button's jammed! I think Betty's still inside. Jeez, man, the latch is melted. Locked. How the hell did he get through? I think he ran through. You can do that? It's only one way to find out. Yo, I have a pretty good brother. He was very caring. I can dash through it? Uh, won't all these people get a little freaked out? Elsa's a bioterrorist, too. Oh my gosh, Wait, yeah. he's not... What do I do? Fine, go. Um, Control the mobs. I'm coming back with help. You know... See if Betty's in there with the bioterrorist. And be careful. I know what those freaks are capable of. Yeah. Those freaks. Where'd they go? Find a way in. Uh, well. I gotta do something. Betty needs me. You know? <laughs> oh my gosh. Enter. Oh! I can go into these. Okay. Oh, there we go. Vince! Good to know. Okay, so I can smoke dash into the vents. Not good. Uh, please don't die. Wow, that should have hurt. Okay. Betty, where are you, Betty? Hold on, Betty. Okay, so I gotta go through the burning timbers. So what is burning? In oh. here? Oh my God. Hit timber. Yeah, this will work. Don't want to spoil the surprise. All right, let's just sit everything down with this chain. Almost there, Betty. You gotta get out of here, lady. Stay away from I'm me. I'm trying to help no, you, lady. Stay away from me. Stop. Stop. Delson. I was just trying to create a diversion. I didn't know anybody was in you here. You did this to me. You're a conduit. Uh. Betty, I'll explain later. But you gotta get out of here now. Good, I'm gone. Not until you fix this first. I spend most of my life behind bars. It's easy enough to bust out. You just gotta wait for that golden opportunity. When I got my powers, hell, I was... Unstoppable. Until the DUP caught up with me. Yeah, they got a special hole they like to toss folks like me in. Figured out a way to bind us all up so we couldn't use our powers. That also meant they had to feed us, wash us, even wipe our goddamn asses. That's no way for a man to live. There's no way. They had this red-headed there. Really into needles and scalpels. She called what she did to me tests. But if you do enough time, you learn a few tricks. You just gotta be patient. Sooner or later, they'll screw up. They always do. You maybe see something or you hear something, learn things you weren't supposed to know. So when that put the three of us in that wagon, I knew what was coming. A golden opportunity. around inside my head. It was me, I thought that was you. You saw it, right? That DUP prison. If she catches you, that's where you're going. Wait, wait, wait! Oh, I'm gonna go oh, come back! Oh. Oh. I'm warning you, kid! Back off! I'm not going anywhere until you fix this! Listen, I don't know what happened, but you better be ready to disappear. Why? You're a conduit now, it. kid. Oh. A bioterrorist. Welcome to the world of run for your life. 
And that's what I aim to do, even if I gotta go through you. I'm not going anywhere until you fix this! This ain't something that can be fixed! Then... At least show me how to control it. Ain't got time! J.U.P.'s coming! And she knows I'm on to her plan! This fire's only gonna buy two, three minutes to version top! I gotta get now! Ain't going back to Curtin K! Yeah, well... Whoever's coming is coming for you, man, not me! You've been seen, son! Folks here know about you! She's got a way of making people talk! Good luck, kid! No way I'm gonna die in a fish guttery! Listen, you... Let me go! Just let me walk away! Nobody's ever gotta know about any of this! Wait a minute! Stop! Let's talk about this! Oh, Henry. I am so very disappointed in you. Well, we got him, right? I, uh, flushed that mean old conduit for you. Good job, everybody. Especially you, guys. Bioterrorist. Henry Daughtry. I was a bioterrorist. Conduit. <laughs> He's a word used by traitors who sympathize with their cause. You're not a traitor, are you? I, uh, I, I try not to be. <laughs> <laughs> you seem nervous. No, I'm, I'm not nervous. <laughs> it's been my experience. There are only two reasons for people to be nervous. Either they're cowards, or they have something to hide. Well, you know, I also get... Nervous around pretty girls. You were in there with that bioterrorist for some time. Did he share anything with you? Um, share. Did he say anything to you? Share any of his ramblings about conspiracies? Um, um no, he didn't. He didn't share anything. <laughs> That's good to hear. You see, we are engaged in a life and death war with these bioterrorists, and it's my job to do whatever it takes to ensure that we win that war. What? Well, that's kind of funny because <laughs> aren't you a bioterrorist too? Okay, okay. Okay. Yes, I am. Sometimes you have to fight fire with fire. And it's clear now that you're not a coward, which means there's something that you're not telling me. Oh, what, are you, what are you doing? You can't do this, you crazy! I've got rights! And I have the legal authority to suspend those rights whenever I feel it's necessary. Like now, for instance, I'll ask again. What happened in there? And I will tell you again. I'm told that hurts. Maybe I know what happened in there! No! Betty! Really? Still nothing. Well... Unless you decide that you do have something to tell me, I'll go chat with that nice old lady. But you should know, concrete is especially hard on brittle bones. And if she doesn't talk, I'll just move on to the next one, and the next, until I find someone who does. So do you have something you want to tell me? Or do you prefer that I move on to your friends here? No, oh, please don't hurt Betty. I don't want them to hurt Betty. <laughs> I could turn turn yourself in, sacrifice the tribe. Oh no, don't sacrifice the tribe. I'm just gonna turn myself in. Risking your freedom to protect Betty is the first step to becoming a hero. So that's how I can become a hero in this one. Putting others in danger to save yourself is the first step to becoming infamous. So this is how the decision making works. I do not feel comfortable sacrificing Betty 
Um, I And apparently we're in the same tribe. So I have to turn myself in. But if you guys are interested in seeing the infamous decisions, just go ahead and let me know in the comments section. I'm a conduit. What? I said, I'm a conduit, all right? I caught it a second ago from, from that guy. Oh, you caught it. Very funny. Ah! God! Telson! So, Betty, maybe you can give me a straight answer. No! Yeah, I'm told that hurts. You have taken your first step to becoming a hero. into a hospital? Stop her. Bro, she did this to everyone? Oh my gosh, she's evil. Oh my god. Betty. Delson, dear, you're awake. So did Augustine do this to you? Yeah, don't you think I was gonna rat you out to that ornery trot? Besides the time it seemed like all the cool kids were getting their legs pierced so that means everyone here we're a comish we protect our own no one here blames you for what happened yeah neither should you hey can't be ashamed for what you are can't help it we were born that way it matters is I'm one of them now. You are not one of those beady-eyed bioterrorists who go around killing people higgly piggly. You're a good boy. Just happen to have smoke coming out of your fingers. It's the whole reason why we're in this is smoke coming out of my fingers. Hey. Don't go down that road. If you're gonna be such a buzzkill, I'm gonna have to go back to sleep because I need my rest so that I can get better and get on my feet again. And I can rest now because you're awake. You know what you worry. I'm gonna be fine. Really? Mm hmm. Just see. Lose you there. A little concrete in the legs. It's a thing more than that. 
Oh. Glad to see fast healing seems to be a part of your new, uh, thing. Uh, speaking of which, uh, the craziness with the hands, is that gone? Yeah, I don't know, man. There's no smoking in the longhouse, remember? All right. And I wouldn't want to get in the way of anyone's recovery. Recovery? Hey, Delson, these, these people aren't getting any better. They're dying, man. You don't know that. No, but the doctors who came through here when you were out, they do. And they said that... They said the only way those shards are coming out is the exact same way they went in. What? Yeah. But that, that was Augustine and her concrete power. Yeah. Then screw it, man. Looks like you and me are going to Seattle and we're gonna go get her. Whoa, 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 wait, what? You think you're just gonna charm her into coming back here with you? Come on, man, I know you took a bump to the head, but you two didn't exactly hit it off last time you were together. Reggie, I did this, and I gotta fix it. No, Delson, you just got back on your feet. Look, I know you want to help, but the doctors have already said the only- The only way it's getting out is with the same power, I get it. Which means, we don't actually need Augustine. We just need her power. <laughs> okay, now you've lost me. Power sponge, remember? If I got smoke, why can't I get concrete? <laughs> yeah, but what, what if smoke was just a fluke, huh? I mean, think about it, you'd have to go through, a, what, a thousand DUP guys just to get to her? Yeah, probably something like that. I'll explain in the truck. What truck? I don't have a truck, I... That's my truck. So, that was a lot that has happened. Um, I, I met some interesting people. My brother, Betty, who seems like a mother. I am a part of a tribe. And there is an issue with me being a conduit now. Now the stone lady is after me. And I have to really be careful with what's going on. I have also decided to take the hero's path. I'm very excited to get back into it because I know how much I do love this game and hopefully you guys will love this game as much as I do but we're going to end it here so thank you fam for chilling with me and see you on our next adventure